Welcome to Easy Driver, the most reliable source of automotive information on YouTube. Mastering the Grease Lubrication System, a complete guide. The Grease Lubrication System is a critical component in many types of machinery and equipment, playing a vital role in reducing friction and wear between moving parts. This video will delve into the inner workings of grease lubrication systems, providing a comprehensive overview of their function, importance and maintenance. Whether you're a mechanical engineer, a maintenance technician or simply someone with an interest in understanding how things work, this post will offer valuable insights into the world of grease lubrication systems. From the basics of how grease lubricants are formulated to the specific applications and benefits of grease lubrication, we've got you covered. By the end of this video, you'll have a clear understanding of the role that grease lubrication systems play in keeping machinery running smoothly, as well as practical knowledge for ensuring the proper maintenance and performance of these systems. Please comment, like, subscribe and share our video. Thank you. So let's dive in and demystify the world of grease lubrication. Understanding the grease lubrication system. When it comes to ensuring the smooth operation of machinery and equipment, understanding the basics of a grease lubrication system is essential. This system plays a crucial role in reducing friction and wear between moving parts. Let's delve into the specifics of grease lubrication. What is grease lubrication? Grease lubrication involves the use of a semi-solid lubricant, commonly referred to as grease, to minimize friction and wear between mechanical components. Unlike oil lubrication, which uses liquid lubricants, grease consists of a base oil thickened with a soap-like material. This thickening agent gives grease its semi-solid consistency, allowing it to remain in place and provide long-lasting lubrication. Components of a grease lubrication system A typical grease lubrication system comprises several key components, each with a specific function. These components include grease fittings, grease guns, grease hoses, and grease dispensers. Grease fittings serve as the entry points for grease application, while grease guns are used to apply grease to the fittings. Additionally, grease hoses enable the transfer of grease from the dispenser to the fittings, ensuring proper lubrication of machinery and equipment. Advantages of Grease Lubrication System Grease lubrication offers several advantages, making it a preferred choice in various industrial applications. One of the primary benefits is its ability to adhere to surfaces and stay in place even under high temperatures and extreme operating conditions. This characteristic ensures continuous lubrication, reducing the frequency of maintenance and lubrication intervals. Moreover, grease provides effective sealing, protecting components from contaminants and moisture infiltration. In essence, understanding the grease lubrication system is integral to maintaining the efficiency and longevity of mechanical systems. By grasping the fundamental principles and advantages of grease lubrication, industries can mitigate wear, reduce friction, and prolong the lifespan of their equipment. Stay tuned for the next sections where we will explore the maintenance considerations and best practices for implementing a grease lubrication system. How the Grease Lubrication System Works The Grease Lubrication System, a vital component in machinery maintenance, functions by applying grease to various moving parts within the equipment, ensuring smooth operation and preventing friction-related wear and tear. Grease Application Methods Grease can be applied in different ways, including manual application using a grease gun, centralized grease systems and automatic lubrication systems. The manual application involves directly squeezing grease onto the lubrication points, while centralized and automatic systems distribute grease through mechanical pumps or injectors. Each method is chosen based on the specific needs of the equipment and the frequency of lubrication required. Functioning of the Grease Lubrication System In the Grease Lubrication System, the grease is stored in a reservoir where it is then pumped through distribution lines to the lubrication points. When the equipment is in operation, the moving parts create an action that draws the grease into the contact areas, forming a protective layer that minimizes friction and heat generation. This method of lubrication greatly extends the lifespan of mechanical components and ensures the efficient operation of the machinery. The simplicity and effectiveness of the grease lubrication system make it a popular choice for a wide range of industrial applications. Proper lubrication not only reduces maintenance costs and downtime, 
but also contributes to the overall efficiency and longevity of mechanical equipment. Types of Grease Lubrication Systems When it comes to grease lubrication systems, there are several types to consider, each with its advantages and applications. Let's take a look at the different types of grease lubrication systems that are commonly used in various industrial and automotive settings. Manual Grease Lubrication System The manual grease lubrication system involves the manual application of grease to the components that require lubrication. This is often done using a grease gun, which allows for precise application of grease to specific points on machinery or equipment. While this method provides control over the amount of grease applied, it requires regular monitoring and can be labor-intensive. Automatic Grease Lubrication System Automatic Grease Lubrication Systems, on the other hand, are designed to deliver the right amount of grease to specific lubrication points at predetermined intervals. This is achieved through the use of pumps, injectors or progressive feeders, ensuring consistent and efficient lubrication without the need for manual intervention. Such systems are particularly beneficial for equipment operating in challenging environments or remote locations. Centralized Grease Lubrication System In centralized grease lubrication systems, a central pump station or reservoir supplies grease to multiple lubrication points throughout the machinery or equipment. This type of system simplifies maintenance by centralizing the lubrication process, ensuring that all components receive the necessary lubrication without the need for individual lubrication points to be serviced separately. Single Line Grease Lubrication System Single Line Grease Lubrication Systems are designed to deliver grease to individual lubrication points through a single supply line. By controlling the volume and frequency of lubricant distribution, these systems provide targeted lubrication to specific components, making them suitable for applications where precise lubrication is essential. Dual Line Grease Lubrication System Dual line grease lubrication systems utilize two main lines to distribute grease to multiple lubrication points. This type of system is advantageous for applications where long supply lines are necessary or when the lubrication points are located at a considerable distance from the central pump or reservoir. The dual line configuration ensures reliable grease delivery to various components, enhancing overall equipment performance. Each type of grease lubrication system has its own set of benefits and considerations and the choice of system depends on the specific requirements of the machinery or equipment in question. Understanding the differences between these systems is crucial for selecting the most suitable lubrication solution for optimal performance and longevity. Maintenance of Grease Lubrication Systems Proper maintenance is crucial for ensuring the smooth operation and longevity of grease lubrication systems. Neglecting maintenance can lead to costly repairs, downtime and potential safety hazards. Importance of proper maintenance. Regular maintenance of grease lubrication systems is essential to prevent equipment failure and breakdowns. It helps in ensuring that all components are functioning optimally, reducing friction, heat and wear. Adequate maintenance also extends the lifespan of the equipment, saving on replacement costs. Moreover, it contributes to overall operational efficiency, reducing energy consumption and enhancing the performance of machinery. Key maintenance practices Regular inspection Scheduled visual inspections of the lubrication system can catch early signs of wear, leaks or blockages, preventing potential damage or system failure. Lubricant monitoring. Regularly check and analyze the condition of the grease to ensure it meets the required specifications and to avoid contaminants that could compromise the system's performance. Appropriate grease application. Use the right type and amount of grease for each lubrication point to ensure effective lubrication without causing over-lubrication or complications due to incorrect grease application. Equipment cleaning. Keep components and fittings clean to prevent dirt and debris from compromising the effectiveness of the grease lubrication system. Regreasing schedule. Establish a consistent regreasing schedule based on equipment usage to maintain optimal lubrication levels and replenish grease that may have degraded or dissipated. By adhering to these key maintenance practices, operators can ensure that their grease lubrication systems operate efficiently reducing the risk of equipment failure and maximizing the lifespan of machinery. 
Remember, neglecting maintenance can lead to costly repairs, prolonged downtime and potential safety hazards, while regular maintenance can help in preventing these issues, ensuring the smooth operation and longevity of grease lubrication systems. Common Issues and Troubleshooting When it comes to the grease lubrication system, there are common issues that can arise, and knowing how to troubleshoot them is essential for maintaining optimal performance. Overgreasing and undergreasing. Overgreasing can lead to excessive pressure and heat, causing seals to fail and the lubricant to ooze out, while undergreasing can result in metal to metal contact and increased friction. Both scenarios can lead to premature equipment wear and failure. Contamination and blockages. Contamination such as dirt, water, or other foreign substances can compromise the effectiveness of the grease, leading to component wear. Blockages within the system can disrupt the flow of grease to critical areas, causing insufficient lubrication. Signs of system malfunction. Recognizing signs of system malfunction is crucial for timely intervention. Look out for excessive heat, unusual noises, vibration or visual indications of grease leakage as these can point to underlying issues within the lubrication system. Troubleshooting techniques. When troubleshooting the grease lubrication system, start by identifying and addressing the root cause of the issue. This may involve adjusting the greasing frequency, inspecting and cleaning the system for contaminants, or verifying the functionality of pumps and dispensing units. Regular maintenance and adherence to manufacturer guidelines for lubricant types and application methods are imperative in resolving and preventing system issues. Incorporating these troubleshooting techniques can help ensure the grease lubrication system operates at peak efficiency, prolonging the lifespan of equipment and minimizing costly downtime. In concluding this video, we've covered the essential aspects of the grease lubrication system. From understanding its function to the types and key components, it's clear that proper lubrication is vital for machinery longevity and performance. By maintaining the right lubricant levels and adhering to a consistent maintenance schedule, businesses can reduce downtime and costly repairs, ultimately improving their bottom line. Embracing the best practices outlined here will undoubtedly enhance equipment reliability and efficiency. Stay tuned for more insightful articles on optimizing industrial processes. Please do comment, like, share and subscribe for more automotive information like this. Thank you for watching.